girls, it's Jessie here and I thought I'd jump on today and talk all about knits. We are um, heading into the colder months here in New Zealand, it's getting into autumn and winter and so we're starting to think about layering up, wearing some warm things but we also want to feel stylish, fashionable while staying nice and comfortable. I wanted to try on some things today that I have never tried on before. The first one I've to put it on today is the channel jumper and I put it on over top of my bias slip um, and I've got my so it's playing with that birds rule. It's made of this really nice thick terry knit and it's nice and um, long in the sleeves coming all the way down to my wrists. It's got this gorgeous channel collar. So it adds a little bit of warmth around my neck. You can wear it like a scarf if you want to and I'll come back with a second outfit. All right, here we are in outfit number two which is the subtraction tee. And this one is made out of this gorgeous visco spandex fabric that is really comfortable and stretchy. And it's such a nice wide fit, so it's a one size and it is super comfortable. It's one of those ones that you can just throw on over your head and you're good to go. It has these cutouts that have been sewn back together again to create this texture and it's all over. And it just elevates the piece, it just adds something interesting other than just being a plain piece. I'm wearing mine today with the Mika Batsu earrings. These ones are my favourite of the new Mika drop and they just go so well with this print, don't you think? Now I've got on the black version of the subtraction tee and it's made out of the same viscose spandex fabric that is so stretchy and comfortable and it's nice and wide, the one size, and it's got those cutouts that have been sewn back together again to give that awesome like texture on the front so it's not just plain um, and it really elevates the outfit. So next up I've got the Thumbelina mesh on and um, this one's in the abstract black and white print and I absolutely love this one. I think it's so modern and cool and I've actually got it on backwards right now because I like things with a nice high neck. Um, so you've got the tag here but you know if you own it you can just cut the tag off, no big deal. This one gives me a nice low back but if you have it on front ways it has a nice v-neck um, if that's what you prefer. So I've actually got the short labella in black and so that one um, it comes to about here on me and so I'm wearing the Sadie wide legs underneath and so that just elongates the body it covers that little strip of skin you would have seen my ankles adds another layer of warmth perfect for the autumn time. And another way to layer up the thumbelina is the get out the girls dress. So I'll pop this one over the top. There are so many different ones that you could um, pop on on top of the Thumbelina. We've got the Valerie A, we've got our bias slips, we've got the Athena tunics, the long and short version, a whole bunch of different colours. I just love how this looks. There's a million different ways that you can style this um, and with the get out the girls dress on top it is perfect. So my next autumn winter outfit is the Splice Girls top and it has this colour blocking patchwork look to it and it is the picture of confident style. It is the perfect outfit that you just throw on and it is so comfortable. I've got it on with my bias slip underneath but you can wear this with your um, semi wide legs, maybe even the mesh. There's so many different ways that you can wear this. Um, this one is also reversible so you could wear it the other way. I'm just going to turn it around for you because why not? And um, this way is actually backwards to have more of the black showing, but front ways it has more of the stripes showing. So if you're a stripy gal, this one is perfect for you. This one also comes in red, and you don't have to give up your comfort to feel um, stylish in the winter time. And I hope that you like this video and um, let me know what you think in the comments. And um, if there's anything that you would like to see for the autumn and winter time, yeah, let us know what your favorite TCD winter piece is. We'd love to hear your thoughts. Love you all. Bye bye.